Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing the next uh, video in the media series that I've been doing where I talk about my favorite media items and today I'm going to talk about my favorite podcast that I've been binging on lately. This is a podcast that I listen to on iTunes. I'm going to link it down in the information bar. I download it on my computer. I download it on my iPod so I can listen to it when, when I'm going for walks. Um, my favorite thing to do is listen to it at night when I can't sleep. It's uh, I learn a lot from it. It's inspirational. It's very calming for me. So I can listen to a couple podcasts and, um, you know, learn. Or it just helps calm me and soothe me and take my mind off of whatever my brain is busy about and helps me to fall asleep. Um, it's an inspirational podcast. And um, so if you're looking for that type of thing, I would encourage you to try it. Uh, it is a, it is a Christian-based podcast. Here's what I want to say if you're non-religious in any way or if you're not Christian. Um, just ignore the parts that are about the Bible if you need to and just listen for the really good advice because this woman is really smart and she's been through a lot and there's really good just in general life advice in there that I think you can extrapolate or extract from the um, you know, religious portion of the conversation and get plenty out of it. Um, so the podcast I'm talking about is uh, Joyce Myers, and I it took me a while to get used to her. She's got a very low, gruff voice. Um, sh her personality is similar to mine in that she's sort of sarcastic and a little, um, I don't want to say antisocial, but um, I don't know. She could be off-putting to some people, I think. Um, not on purpose, not because she's a bad person or whatever, but, uh, you know... I have that kind of personality type too, where you're just kind of unapologetic and um, I don't follow all the norms that are expected from women and I was raised by men so I'm a little more aggressive and I'm a little more blunt. I'm probably a lot more blunt. Not in a mean way, just, um, you know, I just uh, say things and uh, don't do it. I don't tiptoe around things or say what you want to hear and then do what I want to do. Cut, like. A lot of women are taught to do um, and people don't know how to do how to deal with that from a woman she's a little bit that way um, and you know but she's got she's got reason to be to have a little bit of a personality that's on edge um, but when you watch her for a little while you start to see that she's really softer it's just partially because her voice is so gruff and just the way she speaks and she'll she'll nail you you know when when it's something like look you have to do this um, she just lays it out for you and she's unapologetic about it and um, so you kind of have to just get used to her personality a little bit but and the more you watch her though the more you'll see her soft side and you'll know everything she says comes from a good place right so um, I just I just love it and I'm running out of episodes um, because I had like a hundred of them on my computer because I downloaded a bunch all at one time and so I've been, I listen to a bunch every night because I'm a horrible sleeper um, and I'm running out and I don't know what I'm going to do <laughs> at night when I run out. I'm going to have to start saving them or something so that I can listen to them multiple times. But anyway, it's just really inspirational. The thing about her is she was raped by her father her entire childhood and really had a rough way to go. And so when she says like, she knows where you're coming from or she made those mistakes she's not kidding right so her advice is really really good she's in her 70s now i think um so she's got a lifetime of living you know to sort of preach from and i think you can really get uh, get a lot from it i mean i just you can sort of feel that her heart is in the right place as she talks to you so Anyway, I've really just been enjoying it, and so, again, I'm going to link it down in the information bar. Um, I'm hoping that you'll try it if you've, if you, you might be familiar with her already because she is very popular, but if you've never um, listened to the podcast, you know, give it a try, and uh, if you try it, let me know. Come back and let me know what you think, because I think, I'm hoping that you'll really enjoy it. There's such smart information in there, and if you're the kind of person who really likes to work on yourself... Um, don't go into it thinking I'm a horrible person and I'm a total screw up and I need help, you know, being better, you know, go into it like I'm an amazing person, but I can always, you know, I can always work and try to do things, do better every day. 
um, you'll get some good things to think about that you can sort of implement through your, you know, throughout your everyday life. So I hope you'll try it and I hope you'll enjoy it. And if you're new to my channel, then please subscribe and uh, I will see you next time. Bye.